Hello! Fear the Meerkat here. Welcome to another episode of... Uh, I don't know where to walk to get past the fence. Aha! Right, um, another episode of Let's Pray Life is Strange Before the Storm. If it hasn't actually gotten that strange yet, hopefully life will get stranger later. Here, Twitch. Don't call me that. True North. A jock so dumb he makes jocks look bad. Guess Nathan Prescott made the shit list. Oh wow. This is some really weird crap, Prescott. It's not yours. Give it back. I hate that you're on the team now. You're such a loser. Wanna take this elsewhere, guys? The mute speaks? Whoa, whoa! You earn a spot on the squad, Twitch. You don't have your dad try to buy off the coach. At least my family pays tuition. How much financial aid does your deadbeat dad need again? Wow, wow. Prescott is an idiot. Dick uh, move, Nathan. My dad lost his job at the shipyard when your dad closed it down. And you want to talk shit to me? Leave Nathan alone. You know something, Prescott? I'm going to do you a favor. You can't be a part of the team and be into this stupid crap at the same time. You're a piece of shit. I am going stop to it. kill you. You guys, stop! Chloe, do something! Don't just stand there watching! Well, that's fair enough. Okay, hope I don't get this wrong. The only way to stop a bully is to be aggressive. I've got to put Drew down. Back off, idiot. What the hell did you just say to me? Idiot. You're not used to a word that big, are you? Don't be scared. You're seriously defending Nathan Prescott? Congrats. You've actually got me feeling sorry for Arcadia Bay's most spoiled brat. That's how much of an asshole you're being right now. You're such a crazy freak. Mind your own business. You have no idea how crazy I am. Keep pushing and find out. You want a piece of this? Please. Kicking your ass is going to be a piece of cake. <laughs> did you just laugh? I did. Chloe just owned you. Shut the fuck up, fresh meat. You shut the fuck up. Go, Samantha. Guess you got lucky this time, Prescott. Had two girls show up to save you. Take your pervy picture book. Are you okay? You think I need help? From you? You're welcome. Are you alright? Thanks for sticking up for him. People think just because of his family. Everything okay here? <laughs> no problem, Skip. My goodness, security is doing its job. In such a timely fashion as well. Actually, no, I don't like the, uh... The way things were left either, but... Well, I made my choice, and uh, to be honest, it's a little frustrating because it's really Chloe who's making the choices. She still decides what class, most of the words are. Excuse for mom to sick David on me. I know, but I want to continue talking here for a second. His eyes were its look, a bird. <laughs> That's probably not 
That's very really impressive as I make it sound. <laughs> oh well. I would sacrifice a goat to Jeremiah Blackwell himself if it meant I'd be leaving here in a month. I'm really pushing this anti drug thing. Uh, actually, they really don't. Honestly, um, not only are they not really addictive, but they are far less dangerous than alcohol or uh, ordinary tobacco cigarettes. I mean, I'm I'm not gonna go on about this for ages, but seriously, ordinary cigarettes are phenomenally dangerous. It's uh, it's kind of uh, hypocritical of us to make them perfectly legal and expect uh, a little picture and a few words on the box to put people off right, Chloe, smoking them with. They clearly so don't. And then itself. for us to make marijuana illegal. I think they should both be illegal, but anyway, enough of that. Oh, good. You're here. I do beseech you, chiefly that I might set it in my prayers. What is your name? Miranda. Oh, my father, I have broke your hest to say so. Good. Admired Miranda, indeed worth what's dearest in the world. Many a lady I have eyed with best regard, and many a time had listened to... Many a time, the harmony of their tongues Hath I listened to Hayden, you're killing me. You've had weeks to be off book. Sorry, Mr. Keaton. No, don't apologize to me. Apologize to your scene partner, who's been very accommodating, and to your other fellow actors, and most of all, to yourself. Mr. Keaton, sorry to interrupt, but does this look better? I had my mom take it in a bit. Rachel looks awesome. This is getting as surreal as last night. Meow. Looking good, Rach. Very cool. Exquisite, Rachel, as always. Mr. Keaton, I'm still having trouble with... My affections are then most humble. I have no ambition to see a goodlier man. I mean, does she really mean that? Especially because I just straight out told her I've been banging all the ladies. <sighs> yeah, that is hard. We've talked about that line forever. We need a fresh perspective. The question is, are Miranda's feelings of instant passion for Ferdinand just inexperience in dramatic circumstances, or has she actually just met the love of her life? What do you think? Um, might have helped if I'd actually read The Tempest. Sometimes, when you meet someone who's going to change your life, you just know it, I guess. Also, you've got parents coming to see the show, right? At 20 bucks a ticket, it's got to be true love. Wow. wow, that's expensive. A romantic and a cynic. That actually kind of helps me. Thanks. Thanks, Mr. Keaton. Later. See you later, guys. Oh, no. I have first period improv with a class full of freshmen now. Hey, a joke. I'll just be a minute. Okay, so why am I here again? Oh, could you grab my belt for me? I think it's in my bag over there. Uh, y yeah, sure. Okay, uh, get the belt. Don't say any stupid shit and don't, like, fall down. <laughs> Should be doable, right? That's the nicest backpack I've seen in my life. Rachel looks so happy here. Yeah, but it's not about that's a photo.
It didn't say it rummage through my bag. bag. He specifically yes, wants something. Now. No, you won't. Hey now. Sharing is caring. To internet or not to internet. I'm not really sure if you'll be using somebody else's. No. I'm not going to use somebody else's internet, but. RA will suck as Prospera. If VC had any talent, maybe she would have gotten the part. Talent? Is that what got Mr. K to cast you, slut? Guess they don't call it Drama Lab for nothing. Keep on thinking like I'm probably missing something important on that laptop, but I don't want to... I, I won't put it past Chloe to look at this person's emails, so... You know what? Just in case it turns out to be, to be useful information, I'm going to check the computer. Less talk, more I have feelings about this. Most of them are not good feelings. Oh, I don't think there's anything <laughs> Why do theater on kids here anyway. So seriously? All right, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna let you read it. Okay, we're done. I'm not going to be doing that very often because it's boring uh, if you don't feel like reading it, so. I'm going to guess it's from Logan. Uh, Rachel, is this your belt? Yes, <laughs> thank you. Is obviously okay with being forward. I really liked your costume. Thanks. So, did you bring flowers for my dressing room? Uh, how about a belt instead? Perfect. I'll let you finish changing now. Chloe Price. Rachel Amber. Last night was amazing. You call getting attacked by goons amazing? I've got to hang out with you more. Deal. To tell the truth, I went to bed last night wishing it never had to end. But then I thought, why? Why does it have to end? Maybe it doesn't uh, have to end. Exactly. How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Ditch class. You mean it? Is that weird? No, it's awesome. Let's get the hell out of here. Sure, you don't want to just grab the bus or nope. If we're gonna go rogue, we're doing it right. Well, what the hell am I getting into here? I 
last thing I think Cry would be is uh, hesitant about this stuff. Where does this thing go? North? Maybe we'll end up in Seattle. Pull up a chair, Price. The view's amazing. I'm trying to put you cool. Rachel wants me to pull up a chair. Maybe one of these crates. I'm not sure anyone really calls it chem, but never mind. I suck at chemistry anyway. Um. There's my chair. Things heavier than it looks. Guess I should sit down. All right, Chloe. You're on a freaking train with Rachel freaking Amber. Play it cool. I is this nervousness? Is that what this feeling is? Wish Max were here so I could ask. Should I make small talk? Is that what people do? Ah, young love, etc. Uh, <laughs> so, um, what is wrong with you? What? You're acting nervous. So, it's kind of weird that we're hanging out. You mean because I don't hang out with anyone and I don't have any friends? You have friends. Well, I used to. Friend. Singular. Her name was Max, but she left for greener, more northern pastures. That sucks. Hey, so... I want to say thanks. For pulling you out of school? No, dummy. Thanks for last night. Ah. Uh, if you hadn't shown up. Assholes abound in Arcadia Bay. I owe you. That's for sure. Is that... Why you came along? Are you suggesting I should need a reason to ditch school? I bet you're wondering what we're doing. The thought occurred, yeah. Well... I wanted some company. That's it? That's it. Good to fucking go. Anything beats another second in Blackwell. You really hate it there, don't you? You don't? <laughs> right. What reason would Rachel Amber have for hating Blackwell Academy? You're high school royalty. You don't know me. Yet. That's fair enough. Let's do something fun. Okay. I'm listening. Two truths and a lie. What? I think we should play two truths and a lie. It's a game where each person offers up three facts about themselves, two of which are the truth, and one of which is a lie. Right. And then the other person has to guess which is which. I've played this game before. It's uh, not as fun as it sounds. But I am going to play it this time. You know, this game really does all of the talking for me. There's, uh, I don't really have much to say. Sounds fun. You're on. I'll start. First, I'm ambidextrous. Second, I was born in New York, the land of fashion and Broadway. To which I will one day return when my heinous exile here in Arcadia Bay comes to an end. New York, huh? I've never been. Not a world traveler? Not yet, at least. If you could travel anywhere, where would you go? Russia, Greece, Kathmandu? 
Katmandu. One day, I'm going to climb Everest. Why are you still blind? I thought moving away from Arcadia Bay was ambitious. What's your third thing? My third thing? Two truths and a lie. You say three things. Right. I'm a Leo. Meow. Okay. So, ambidextrous, born in New York, and a Leo. Gotcha. So, which is the lie? Well, I wish I could say that I've had enough clues to guess. Uh, I couldn't spot whether she was left-handed or right-handed. I'm not sure she actually held anything in front of us. I'm gonna go with Leo. You're way too lucky to be a Leo. You've gotta be a Sagittarius or something. The Archer? That'd be cool, like Artemis. But I'm afraid I was telling the truth. Oh well. Seriously? Hear me roar. <laughs> no, the lie was New York. I've never been there, though I want to one day. I was born in Long Beach. New York's on the bucket list, man. Sounds good. Okay, your turn, Price. First fact, <laughs> right. Something about myself. Should I start things off with a lie or with the truth? Or should I cheat? Let's see how good she really is at this game. Okay. I am actually thinking hard about this. I figure truth lie truth. Wow, well, we know the top one's not true. Uh, sorry, we know the top one is. Yeah, we know the top one's not true. Um, I think we're gonna go with D. I'm pretty certain that we know that love. I love science is a lie, so. I used to want to be a pirate when I grow up. I kind of still do. Arr. Okay, well, she's not in the band. I'm secretly the lead guitarist of an all-girl Misfits cover band called the Misfits. There's a turbo liar. Just want to answer truth then. Okay, both of these things are a lie. So, okay, we're going to cheat, I guess. Ah, uh, actually, I suppose it's possible she still loves science, and she's just been getting bad grades because of her various emotional issues. I love science. Seriously, I think Neil deGrasse Tyson is the shit. Huh. You're hella mysterious, Chloe Price. Wow, how did she know? Hella? <laughs> Who says that? <laughs> it's a Cali thing. Anyway, I think I have your number. Of course you wanted to be a pirate. Sail the open seas, buckle swash, plunder secret treasure. So, pirate, obviously true. Maybe you'd like to be my first mate. Oh, are you accepting applications? Considering it. Okay, you say you love science, but you are failing chemistry. 
You're saying failing chemistry means I hate science? Or that Blackwell doesn't inspire your best work? That place is a hellhole filled with shit, where shitty people go to be shitty to each other and themselves. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel, though. Anyway, school sucks, but you love science. I'm gonna say true. So, let's talk about this lead guitarist business. The business of show. As much as I'd love to be a groovy to your all-girl cover band, the Miss Fits. I'm gonna have to call Lie on that one. You don't think I can rock? On the contrary, you absolutely rock. The problem is, your hand is smooth, no calluses. You don't play guitar. Pity, too. You'd look hot on stage. Mm, she is so... good. If my math is correct, you told me two truths and one lie. What? You expected me to cheat? Winners make their own rules, Chloe. You are crazy good at this game. A lifetime of studying the human condition. Well, I'm impressed. I bet it's hard to impress Chloe Price. I'm gonna feel good about that one. When your dad is the district attorney, I guess lying is something you're used to. Seriously? Seriously. I know who to call if I need to get out of a ticket then. Not that I have a right of my own. Car first, embarrassing number of moving violations second. Hey, thanks for trusting me. Trusting you? You played the game. And not everyone would admit to wanting to be a pirate. But eye patches are so cool. And rum is delicious. I guess. You opened up a lot. That's all. It's not a big deal. Hate to break it to you, but Chloe Price is not exactly renowned throughout Arcadia Bay as a bastion of trust and empathy. Uh. Trust doesn't exactly come easy to me. Maybe if you'd had my life. You'd understand. No, I get that. On the other hand, I got on this train with you, didn't I? Fair point. Wouldn't mind listening to some music. Yeah, but my ability to, uh, Get, make money from this episode minds whether you listen to music or not. At this point I'd probably be wondering how do we get back. But then as I said, I'm not very similar to Chloe. Hey, wanna listen? Yeah, that's the system affects things greatly. She'll get a horrible ear infection. She won't share though. Uh, add fans with other people. We're getting less into the whole thing. Was longer than I thought. I may actually have cut some of that out. Oh, bracelet. I've had it, I guess, since I was a kid in Long Beach. It reminds me that there's more to experience out there than just Arcadia Bay. Maybe one day I'll go back to Long Beach. Or anywhere but here. 
maybe sooner than later. I really hate to deprive the world of such great music and um, I'm sure that you can find the soundtrack to this game if you look hard enough. I really liked the music of the uh, Life of Strays and so far I'm liking the music of this game. But that did go on for quite some time. Me too. Arcadia Bay can suck a bag of dicks. Sometimes... I feel like I've got no reason to stay. Don't be surprised, Chloe. If one day... I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Check it out! We're here! What? Where is here? Jump and find out! Did you say jump? Jump! Fuck it! It's actually a pretty nice view. Glad you approve. And as your reward for making it up here, I have a new game for us to play. Another one? I like games. Deal with it. This is one I learned in theater class. It's all about improvisation. Okay, well, that's... it's just saved the game um, automatically, and uh, this has been going on for a while, so... I'm going to end the episode here. I'll admit I find it a little frustrating that this guy moves quite really quick, quite slowly. I need to work out the difference between those two. Uh, it just means that I can't get a lot done during the last play. Uh, but I really don't. I really think this has been going on for long enough. I will see you next time.